Hey, good morning. How are you? Ah, Jeff Hansen with uh, Kingdom Fitness. Um, just sharing a uh, little bit. I'm just letting you know, this morning was going about snatching victory out of defeat. Yesterday was a challenging day. Uh, made some bad decisions in the morning. I went to work out. Wasn't as intense out as I wasn't as focused. Um, I got up a little bit earlier than I should have gotten up, 2.30 in the morning. And, um, you know, so I wasn't as focused. I was a little bit more tired. Went back to sleep. Got up about 2.30, 3, 3 in the afternoon. And the crazy part was... I had a speaking engagement. I wasn't. I, I was thinking about canceling that. Um, I hadn't went to New York. I hadn't did what I, I picked up my merchandise. I hadn't done that. And uh, then I wanted to go out and make some money too with the merchandise I needed to pick up. So and my day was running late. But instead of laying down and saying, "Well, I'll just do it tomorrow and scratch this day off as a defeat," what I did was I made sure I hit the goals that I had set for myself. Got up, got dressed, ate whatever, did what I had to do. And um, went to the city, did what I had to do, rushed back, um, had my merchandise and everything, went out, did my speaking engagement. Then I came back and um, got home and then went back out and uh, sold some merchandise, which was great. And the biggest thing and, and the most powerful thing out of that was not so much the situation that faced me. But it was the fact that my mindset was, I will not be defeated. I will not, not go to bed and not hit my goals. I will not. See, I'm a different person now. What I used to do is I would just cancel it and do the same thing tomorrow. I'll just pick it up tomorrow because I'm an entrepreneur and I can adjust my schedule. But yesterday, it was a different mindset. There was a different person that faced the same situation. And that different person snatched victory out of defeat. So that's what my message is to you today. Because if you're going to be inspiring and if you're going to be motivating and if people are going to look at you and be inspired to do something different in their life, they have to see you do, doing not the norm, not the average, not the mediocre. You have to do greater than the average. You have to. A light is that which is brighter than the darkness. Understand a light, which is that which is, is brighter than the darkness. And that's why it stands out. There's, there's a saying that says that. Are you going to fly with the pigeons because pigeons fly in flocks? Or are you going to soar with the eagles because eagles fly alone? You're going to have to stand out from the crowd. You're going to have to be better than, than the worst. Uh, uh, you you got to be better than, um, better than the better. You know what I'm saying? Uh, 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 if you're going to fail, fail fabulously. Fail forward. I mean, if you're going to mess up, really mess up. You know what I'm saying? If you're going to do great, do fantastically great. But don't be in that little timid little area called average. So remember, snatch victory from defeat. I don't care what you strive to do, whether it comes out or not. Temporary defeat is simply that, temporary. So God bless you. It's about 5, 5.30 in the morning. And I'm about to run out here in something that's beyond my norm, which is it's one degrees outside and it's about negative 16 degrees. But I'm going to run to the gym, I'm going to work out, then I'm going to run back. And I'm going to know, guess what? Today, today, I went beyond my comfort zone. I went beyond the average. And I know that I'm closer and closer and closer to my goal. I don't know. Uh, I just know that, and you can do the same thing. Snatch victory from defeat. Snatch victory from defeat. God bless you.